Oh, <laughs> Brenda, Biscuit? you wow. are an angel. Oh, Excuse a mess. We had to block the back door after a walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago, and ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. I'll go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could eat a horse. Where's Mark? Now don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. Walkers aren't getting through that thing. like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV tubes, saline. What would dairy farmers need with this kind of stuff? I guess someone needed some first aid recently. Musty as hell. Candles. Smart. What do they need so much morphine for? Mark. Thought Brenda said he was up here resting. Is that blood? Uh, farm books, cookbooks, nothing out of the ordinary here. to your bags, man! Don't eat dinner. <laughs> Clementine! Time. No! What? Huh? Lee, Jesus, man. Did you find something? Oh, sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Yeah, Lee. What's gotten into you? He just had a start. He could use some goddamn manners. You're eating human meat. That's crazy. What the man? hell? Ridiculous. Oh, scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. It's always something with this guy. Mom, I was eating that. What is going on? Go upstairs and look. You'll find a guy with both of his legs hacked off. This is a dairy, not a ranch. Think about it. It's true. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. Settle down, honey. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boys. 
Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. You're all sick. Sick in the head! Lee, that's not a very nice thing to imply. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways, one way or another. Like y'all. Kenny, get your gun! Kenny, no! Nobody's going anywhere! We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the what? The fucking black Put your fuck? guns down! We're walking you out of here! Near my fucking Mommy, family. I don't want to die. Mommy, what did I eat? We're screwed. <gasps> Lee? Lee? You fucker! I'll tear you apart! Did God damn it! If you hadn't dragged your feet, come on, Dad. Now's not the time. You okay, Clementine? They—they they didn't hurt you, did they? Mm -mm. Open up, Lee. Those psychos have my family, and we're stuck in a damn meat locker. We gotta get the fuck out of here. This goddamn thumb sucker was the one who brought us here. Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. Dad, Don't give up. We're gonna find a way out of here. Can I help? Sure, honey. You keep your eyes open for exposed screws or loose panels. Anything we can pry away to open a passage out of here. Okay. Please settle down. I'll, I'll rip your goddamn heads off and, and make you swallow them. I don't want to know what kind. Come on, show yourself. Our yeah. chills are pretty sturdy. We could climb up. But there's no way out through the ceiling. There's more of us on the way. Let us out now, if you want to live. That is not going to help. Could there be a hole behind these pallets? No such luck. They're not going to open the door. You, you think a fucking apocalypse gives you the right to chop They got caught you, Duck Lee. Me? Those fuckers have my family. I know. We're gonna get out of here and find them. Dad, this isn't helping. Your dad's not making things any easier for us. Open the fucking Dad, door! Dad, stop! God damn it! I'll, I'll break that damn door down! Dad, you can't get... Uh, uh, easy! Uh, oh, God. Dad? No. Dad, come on! Dad! Oh, God. He stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead! Somebody help me! Fuck. If he's dead... He's not dead! You know what has to happen, Lee. Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're gonna be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, three hundred pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you! We can bring him back! Lee! We'll mourn him later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He's not dead! 
Lily can still save him. I wish she could, believe me, I do. But that man is dead. You both know what happens next. Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten, I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on, we know this guy's not gonna make it. Remember what Ben said. You gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. You gotta have my back this time. God damn it, Lee. I need you. Please help me. Come on, Dad. Come on. Wake up. Lee! Is he breathing at all? No. No, I don't think so. Okay, let me take over. Keep checking his pulse. Are you stupid? He's gonna turn! You're putting all of us at what? risk, you son of a bitch! Three. You're freaking worthless, Four. Lee. No! Kenny, <laughs> what the fuck? I'm so sorry. I just... It had to be done. You don't know that! Yes, I do, Lee. And so do you. I was counting on you, man. I'm sorry. I know. Don't you fucking touch me! Are you okay? Is it over? Yes, for now. But we still need to find a way out of here. I know. I know. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else. Something hopeful. Like what? How about your walkie-talkie? Those pretend talks with your mom and dad. Don't those make you feel better? Sometimes. We're gonna get out, right? You found a way out? I'm working on it. I'm sorry, Lily. He was still alive, Lee. He was still alive. Sorry, Lily. I truly am. Larry and me, we might not have got along so great, but I know he would have done anything to protect you. He was a good father. <laughs> there ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off. If I had something to remove the screws, the multi-tool. Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Uh -uh. It's not coming off that way. Please. I need to be alone. God knows you deserve time to grieve, Lily. But if we're gonna get out of here, we need your help. And Larry's. I think I may have found a way out of here, but I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something... No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but... Back at the motor end. Larry... Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your... permission. <sighs> do what you have to do. Oh, boy. Uh, any idea which pocket he keeps his change in? Just gotta remove these 
these screws and get this unit off. Hurry the fuck up, Lee. We don't have all day here. Clementine can fit through. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. You uh, think you can do this? I'm scared. It's okay to be scared. We need you, Clementine. <sighs> okay. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. these people. Maybe I shouldn't have sent Clementine through there. This room would give anybody nightmares. <laughs> Jesus, this is where they butcher people. Outside the barn. Oh shit! Just guarding the place, like you said. Mm. Quit sitting out in the rain like a damn deer. Thomas says we can't keep that many folks alive and not expect trouble. Pick one to keep and kill the rest. And I pick which one to keep alive. 
Not the kids. Turn the meat on the trail. 